welcome back to my channel or hi if you're new here my name is Emma I make YouTube videos mostly vlogs DIYs like the video you're about to see and overall just have a lot of fun so if you're not subscribed to my channel you should go down below and do that so if you want to follow my new Instagram it's also going to be linked down below so look what I have today a flower crown isn't that just so much fun so that's what today's video is we're gonna make flower crowns so backstory behind this at my 16th birthday party I had all of my friends come over and we uh, hung out and drank a lot of tea and we um, made flower crowns it was like my favorite thing ever I made all of my friends do it well, I didn't make them they wanted to anyway but um, so it was super easy and I taught them how to do it so I thought why not teach you guys how to do it so that's what today's video is DIY flower crowns all right guys so what you'll need for this is floral wire floral wire cutter floral tape and flowers if you want to use real flowers you can but I found it easier just to use fake flowers and then these were some that I had left over for my birthday party so the first thing you're gonna do is measure out the size of your head and more importantly the size you want your crown to be and how much you want it or how you want it to fit your head and so what I'm doing here is I am making the size that I want and then going around the loop. I think I did it two or three times and then I cut the wire and then wrapped it around so that there were no points sticking out or anything. So once I made the loop I started picking out the flowers and so that I could figure out what I wanted the flower crown to look like. I only had these smaller flowers at my house from my birthday party as I said before. But if you go to the store, buying bigger flowers makes larger flower crowns, obviously, so it makes them more full and fun looking. A helpful tip is to break them up, and so that you don't have larger clumps of flowers, but always adding more is better. So the easiest way I've found to attach the flowers is to open up a small hole between the wires and put the um, stem of the flower through it, and then using the floral tape, wrapping that around it as much as you can. And here's a close-up shot of me doing that. this video and you thought it was helpful and fun and just you liked it then please be sure to go down and click the like button and also subscribe to my channel again if you're not and leave a comment if you feel like it by the way my new upload schedule will be once every weekend so be sure to check out my channel and look for the new video also click the little bell next to the subscribe button so that you get a notification when I upload a new video so I think that is everything and I will see you guys in my next video bye Oh, I love it.